We're going to make some changes now to our project, and then we're going to add some more filters. So the first thing we're going to do is invert all the colors by pressing Command-I again. Then we want to brighten things up a little, so we're going to go to Image, choose Adjustments, and then choose Auto Levels. Next, we want to apply the wind filter that we just applied before. And we want to apply it three more times. We can do this by going to Filter, and then choosing Wind right away, or by pressing Command F, which I'll do two more times. Then we're going to rotate our canvas one more time. We'll go back to Image, Rotate Canvas, and this time we'll choose 90 degrees counterclockwise. And the last filter that we're going to add is that we're going to add another polar coordinate filter. By going up to Filter, choosing Distort, and then Polar Coordinates. This time we're going to select Rectangular to Polar and simply click OK. You can see our light blast now is beginning to take shape. In the next portion, we're going to add color, and we're also going to make sure that we can read the words we initially put on.